bottom, called stalactite. They grow from the ground towards the ceiling. There's different ones on the ceiling where it's kind of here, dark pools. Those are stalactites. They grow from the ceiling towards the ground. We have a special type of stalactite here, these skinny ones. They look like straws, but they're silver straws. And then in the back, see how there's one going from the ground towards the ceiling. You can see faintly where it's the lagmite and the stalactite touch. A crate is what is called a column. It's the way that they're formed. By the special minerals, it's called calcite itself. So basically, it all starts with rainwater. This rainwater enters the soil, or dirt, picks up carbon dioxide, or CO2, and creates like a weak acid called carbonic acid. It like dissolves or eats the limestone, picks up the mineral known as calcium carbonate. This mixture goes down deeper and deeper and enters the chasm due to the atmosphere. That CO2 evaporates and leaves behind a watery calcite mixture. The water will be curved either by dripping or flowing. Water will evaporate and basically leave behind that calcite in its place. Now this process will be done over and over. The growth rate is one cubic inch for every hundred years. It's about the size of refrigerators. This was a slide might take about 400 to 500 years to get this size.